Pneumonias can affect all classes of animals, however lambs and recently transported sheep and cattle are most at risk. So pneumonias typically present um, during consecutive hot dusty days in January and February with um, a lot of our clinical presentations being in sheep being a tail of the mob forming some lethargic lambs a lot of the time and also we will see some deaths. The level of coughing in the, in the mob is highly variable but it's generally always observable. In sheep the most common causative agent is mycoplasma, however other bacteria can cause pneumonias as well. So transportation stress and co-mingling of um, naive stock generally can cause um, pneumonias in, in adult livestock. Um, there's a multitude of bacterial and viral etiologies that can cause um, pneumonia. Clinically, you may see um, recently transported animals having a check in weight gain, they may be lethargic, they may be dull, you may see um, increased signs of exercise intolerance and you may also see um, severe respiratory distress with um, livestock having their head stretched out, panting, that type of thing, they may be, go down and they may die from it. Uh, gross pathology of pneumonias is really highly dependent upon the type of etiology, whether it's bacterial or viral um, or a combination of. And what it's associated with. However, um, generally you'll see things like consolidation of the lung parenchyma. You might see fibrin, you might see purulent or pussy material. It really just depends what type of etiology it is. So treatment and um, prevention of pneumonias are really highly dependent on the type of pneumonia it is um, and it's best to get a diagnosis of what type of pneumonia it is and have a chat with your vet about what we can do for your animals. Mm -hmm.